with the biggest houses on the biggest property ever tackled in the reality series history, the block tree change was always going to be tough. But as the end of the build nears and contestants race to finish their homes, and the 10-acre yards around them, panic is starting to set in. This is more than just a big job, Scotty Cam and the blockheads are starting to realize, it's massive. And for some, it might be impossible. I reckon there's at least one team, maybe two, who want finish, Scotty, 59, tells TV Week. As I've always said, I only need one team to finish to prove that it was possible to do and at least one team will finish, so I am off the hook, but with the others it's a matter of being realistic about what they can afford and what they can achieve. That's what the block is all about, making decisions about what is achievable in the time frame that we've given with the budget that we've given so it is not our fault if teams have bitten off more than they can chew and they don't finish what they want to do. And Scotty's not the only one with doubts, Gold Coast carpenter Jenny, half of House 4's team with her fiancé Dylan, said all the blockheads are feeling the pressure. There's just so much still left to do, it's hectic. Jenny, 26, says. At our house we still have pretty much all the landscaping to do and all finish the huge deck around the outside of the house. At our house we still have pretty much all the landscaping to do and all finish the huge deck around the outside of the house. That's about 1.6 kilometers of decking to be laid, in one week. I know how building works in the real world and I just can't see this getting done, especially not when minutes before the final tools down. Call from Scotty, a distracted Jenny is rushed to hospital after an on-site accident with less than an hour before tools down that was the last thing I needed to happen, Jenny says of the incident that will play out in the closing moments of the block build. It was a crazy 12 weeks.